Godlike. Come on, we need another one. Another one, another one. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be opening up some special delivery crates. I do have over 8,500 coins saved up uh, in total. And uh, also, we're going to be doing some gameplay of the Megalodon Orochi uh, using the Thunder Weapons. Okay, so let's get started with opening up some of these crates here. Um, I haven't opened up any of these, as you can see. Um, let's take a look at the 100 crate. And from this, I'm hoping to win um, nuclear you know, amplifier, also the uh, flamethrower pilot, because I don't have that. And um, I think uh, power cells and I guess the uh, gold coins would be good. And uh, let's take a look at uh, this one here. So what really actually interests me the most is the Freedom Favnir. So um, I actually want to win that so that, you know, I can sell my other one and then level that one up. Uh, the Manny Pilot uh, would be nice. I think I actually have that from the Creators program though. So I'm just looking to see what else um, would be nice. Gold, Power Cells. And from the most expensive crate, I'm hoping to win the Kisten. So I actually already have the Miramets and the Bulava weapon. As some of that I got from the uh, creator program as well. So uh, let's go ahead, let's open up the 100 um, you know, coin uh, crate here. So let's see what we win. Okay, so... For this one, it doesn't really matter, you know, which one I pick. All of these prizes, for those of you who don't know, has been pretty much predetermined. Um, I did a crate opening on the uh, battle recording account. If you guys haven't checked it out, definitely check it out because uh, you can actually see the prizes uh, being determined before I've even, uh, you know, picked my prizes. Okay, so we have 1,500 um, power cells here. I actually hope I get that one. Okay, that's good. Just keep on going. You know what I might actually do here? Maybe I should just open up the 10 because it really doesn't... Well, it might still matter because it depends on, you know, when you actually click on that button. So let's just go ahead. Let's just do this. Oh, I don't know if you guys caught that. Um, you know, my gold coins went up. So it means that I've probably won some of these uh, gold coins here. Let's see if it shows it up. Okay, so we have 50. Um, what other things did I win? Power cells? Oh, we actually won a shell. Hmm. I wonder if any of you guys have won the shell from the uh, smaller crate. You know what? I should try that on my baby account. Let's see what we win here. Open automatically. And we got a freedom um, igniter. So that's actually pretty cool. Nope, looks like I'm going to be winning uh, some gold coins here from this one too. <laughs> oh, I wonder if I won the pilot. I think I saw the flamethrower one, that pilot here. Did I win it? No, I got the ghost. Okay, let's just keep on going. Oh, looks like I'm winning gold. <laughs> so we've got some gold coins uh, here that I do win. Let's just open that up. A lot of power cells, but power cells are very good. So we have to open up the uh, the hundred here. Ooh. Hmm. I wonder if I'm going to be getting the flame, the uh, igniter. Yes, I actually got the igniter. So I kind of need more of these. I was going to run, um, you know, these on. I'm trying to remember. I think maybe it was my Favnia, but I only had one of them. I didn't want to run one and then like the normal, because it kind of looks uh, odd having. <laughs> different weapons I'm not sure if I'm the only one that that's like that but like if I have like for example I'm trying to think like a freedom uh, igniter and a regular one and I put it on like a Demeter for example you know I would either have all regular or all freedom igniter I'd never mix it up because it kind of looks weird like that Ooh, I wonder if I'm gonna get the pilot here I hope I do no, we got another shell. Whoa, they're giving away a lot of shells here. So what I typically do is when I win shells like that or whatever robot it is, I tend to sell it and I get uh, silver for that. And then I use it to upgrade or I use a silver to upgrade my weapons. Weapons or robots. Okay, so 
those are the prizes I got from the uh, 100 crate. So we can take a look at this here. So we got two shells, two freedom igniters, and a lot of power cells, but power cells is very good. And components, gold, and more components. Okay, so let's go for the 150 crate. You know what's kind of interesting is when you do it this way. Oh, it actually does show. I just saw that my coins went up. So I'm going to win the 100 here. Yep, you can actually see it. So if you look at the top right where the gold coins is, it pretty much tells you if you're going to win. Even though, well, it actually pretty much means that it doesn't matter what you pick. That's what your uh, prize is going to be. Oh wait, we got the Norse um, paint job. You know what, I think I might actually have that already. I'm not sure. Okay, let's do the the open 10 here. This way you guys don't have to, uh, you know, sit through the whole thing. So I'm wondering uh, what am I gonna get? You know what, I don't even see the uh, Freedom Favnir. Did I even win that? We got some gold, some, uh, you got Scatty. Okay. Another paint job. Oh, and also guys, if you do win the paint job, you can actually sell these paint jobs as well for uh, silver. I know of uh, some players who sold paint jobs and they made a lot of silver. They got a lot of silver back from that. So you can always use that to uh, level up your equipment. Oh, we got a Freedom uh, Scaddy. Nice. Okay, so I'm short on coins here for the silver. So let's just go back. You guys can see the prizes. I think I had better luck on the uh, BR account. Let's see what we get with the uh, 200 now. Let's see if we can try to get something good here. I might just do singles because... Well, I don't think I can actually open up the other one. I'm just realizing it now. So let's set uh, that. Okay, so I'm hoping the Kisten, that's what I want to win actually from this. I think these components, I'm going to end up just selling it. Oh, we won a Sharanga. And uh, also guys, in the comment section below, let me know what has been your best prize that you won from this event so far. What are you hoping to win? So far, I haven't uh, won any. Oh wait, oh, we got the Balava. <laughs> I was hoping it would be the Kisten. Special prize in one. I wonder if I'm gonna get a Kisten. Let's see, special prize in one. This next one's going to be the special prize. Nope, it's going to be these weapons. You know what they should have done? They should have put the, um, the limited edition versions, like the special versions of these weapons. They shouldn't have put the regular ones. Again, just my opinion, but you guys can let me know what you think of that idea for the special prize. Yeah, let's just go with that one. Doesn't really matter what I pick. So let me just go back. And uh, you guys can see what we won from this event. So Freedom Igniters, Freedom Scaddy. That Scaddy kind of looks cool, but again, I'm not going to run one of these and the regular one, um, you know, on a robot. It just looks kind of weird. So that's pretty much what I won with the 8,500 coins. So this, uh, this opening here wasn't too bad. Um, the BR account was obviously better because I had more coins, but when I look at you know what I won from this event versus the previous one, I think this event, um, the prizes seem better. Okay, so we've just dropped in on Shenzhen map and um, I have started with my Arachi first. So I hope this game is gonna be okay. Man, I've had a couple of very rough games. 
Okay, so we are dealing with um, a Demeter here. I wonder if I can take this guy out. Man, I'm missing him completely. What the heck? Let's just wait until his shield drops. Of course he has a shield again. But wait, hold on a second. Let's just do that. Yeah, so the build that I'm running right now, what makes it kind of tricky is that you don't actually have a last and he got off the beacon. <laughs> yes. And if it looks like I'm missing a lot, it's also because the reload time. You have to remember the reload time on these weapons. They're not... Uh, it's kind of like actually devastator weapons. You know, once you fire everything, there's a long reload. It's the, uh, the wait time in between shots, the interval. There we go. I started firing uh, singles. I should have probably done that uh, earlier, but I started firing uh, singles in the hopes that uh, that would help. Okay, let's see if we can maybe uh, get this shell. <laughs> I just went straight for the shell. Okay, wait. Oh, they got another one. They got another one. Okay, hold on a second. Let's see. Can we break this? Can we crack the coconut? Oh, wait. Oh, oh. We did. Holy shoot. And those players typically run maxed out uh, bots too. So this bot is close to max. This sin player. Okay, let's try to see if we can maybe do that. There we go. Nice. And we got this beacon. I'm actually having a pretty good run here with this. And I should be careful when I say that because you never know what this guy, this player has. Oh, oh, hold on a second. Uh oh, uh oh. Uh oh, yes, rampage! Uh oh, uh. What does this player have? Yep. Yes! Oh my gosh! Godlike! Come on, we need another one. Another one, another one. Uh-oh. They got an Arthur there. I'm going to get killed. Ah! Use ability quick. Yes, beyond godlike. I got to escape. 14,000 health. Man, I'm going to be so dead. Oh, come on. Oh, man. Wait a minute. What the heck is going on here? Oh, shoot. They've got a Minos on our spawn. Oh man, we gave them the beacon. Oh no, wait, my team. Come on, get another beacon quick. I'm gonna stand over here just in case someone drops in behind me. Then I can... Oh, I was gonna say, then I can blast him. Of course it has to be an Ao Ming. Um, you know what I can do here? Oh shoot, we're losing another beacon. Okay, so I'm gonna go to center. Maybe we can change this. This, <laughs> this Loki's running, he's running like crazy. Don't go to another beacon, dude. <laughs> I'm going to push this one. Maybe if I push this one, then they'll start dropping in over here away from the other beacons. We're losing another beacon somewhere. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Oh my gosh. Someone's hitting. Oh, jeez. We need, we need another, we need another beacon. Crap. This might be enough to take out this Arthur. Yes! Oh shoot, don't spawn in here. We need this beacon quick. Quick. Let's take out this player. Yes, we're gonna get it. We got it. Nice. Wait a minute, Rampage? Who did I just kill? The guy that I was aiming at down there? Uh-oh, uh-oh, uh-oh. Man, this, uh, this is getting kind of crazy. I need to drop in here quickly. <laughs> this is, this is, this is kind of nuts. Wait, hold on. We might be able to get uh, this Demeter here at center. Hold on. There we go. There we go. Trying to move forward here. Yes. Okay, so we got we got this side. Um, I think. Oh man. No, why did this guy drop in over there? Oh shoot, that was a terrible mistake, dude. A Ming? I don't know if I would have dropped a Ming like that. I mean, right pretty much next to their spawn. What if they had like an Arthur with shotguns? 
I'm trying to get on over to uh, this beacon here. They actually moved off the beacon so that I'm I kind of have my foot on it. <laughs> oh come on! Are you serious for real? Yes, he. Oh man, push him off. This guy. <laughs> he doesn't bother with me. Oh man! Oh oh oh! You know what? I think I could actually take this uh, player. He's trying to push me off this beacon. I'm trying to stay on this beacon here. Yes! Oh, that was close. Okay, okay, we got, we got this, we got this. This is good. I'm trying to get on over to that side. <laughs> this game's getting kind of, it's getting kind of intense now. Except we have more players than they do. I kind of wiped out quite a few players though. Yes! Do they have another one? I don't think so. Wait, what is that in our spawn? Okay, hold on a second, hold on a second. There's a, uh, there's a player over here. I'm gonna drop in with my... With this. Oh, I tried to hit him. I, oh, that's an Arthur. Catch. Ooh. I think the red team might have been down a player because I'm looking at how many players we have. Okay, wait, hold on a second. This Arthur's actually kind of doing, uh, that's actually smart there, fighting in between like that. Yeah, I can't hit that player. I phase exiled uh, this hawk here. I'm trying to move around the corner so that I can hit this Arthur. There we go, yes! Let's hope he doesn't drop in with a hawk or something here. We need to take out this player. Actually, you know what? This game is a lot closer than, <laughs> than I thought it was. If you look at it, it's three versus two. So we have a five cap here. But man, that was actually pretty intense. And my Arachi did a pretty decent job. You gotta remember, no last stand on there too. 10 beacons, 13 kills. Wow. That is crazy. So no, both sides were actually uh, filled up there. So uh, yeah, that's going to wrap everything up. If you guys happen to miss my other video where I did a massive 50,000 uh, coin opening, definitely check it out. I'll leave a link to that in the video description. And um, I think that's pretty much it. So thank you guys for watching. And until the next video, I'll catch you guys later.